You couldn't blame Lael Collins if he left LSU after his junior season. After all, his stock was pretty high, evidenced by his draft grades. Last year I had um, three second round grades and one first round grade. At the end of the day, I felt like I was worth more than that. And I felt like it was a lot more that I could have came back and proved to scouts to really show them that I feel like I can be a first round draft pick. So, uh, you know, that, that kind of went into my decision making. So Collins accepts any challenge and he also accepts a lot of advice when he was making his decision after his junior season to either stay at LSU or go pro. He heard from a lot of people, but his best advice came from a former LSU star and a family member. It came from my cousin Marcus Spears. Uh, he kind of came at me like, uh, well, you know, like uh, to me when we had a talk, he was like, you know, feel like sound like you kind of you're doubting it a little bit. So it was like, if you got any doubt in your mind, you need to go back to school. So that's what I did. Collins listens to family and takes coaching very well. He may be versatile entering the draft where he can play both guard or tackle, but he also realizes his upside. Where what makes him really attractive is his hunger to always improve. Well, for me, you know, I just take pride in what I do. I take pride in coming out here each and every day. I take pride in having the opportunity to be here, to, to be coached by NFL sc scouts, to go against uh, future NFL players. And uh, I take pride in that. So each day I come out here, I look to get better. So, you know, I try to uh, excel my game in, in every way, in every opportunity that I get. Great attitude, great technique, and great athleticism. The Louisiana native seems a safe bet to be a first rounder, but could he be the Saints' top pick at the 13th spot? That will be great, man. You know, uh, anybody that wants to give me an opportunity to come play and be a part of the program, I look forward to it. Um, I promise you I'm going to give my best, my best effort. I'm uh, going to be all in for him. Away from that, though, to stay close to home, and I don't know if you were a Saints fan growing up. Well, you know, for me, um, you know, like I say, you know, if they gave me the opportunity, I'd definitely be there with open arms, man, be right up the road from where I'm from. Uh, but uh, whoever wants to give me opportunity, I'm willing to give it all out, and uh, it's going to be my new home. The Saints need upgrades on the offensive line, and Collins would certainly help. We'll see if that marriage happens. In the meantime, this former Tiger will continue to work. That's what he does. Mike Neighbors for CST Tonight.